was during my sixth standard. It was the most scary moments of my life. I know it's the scariest moments of every student's life. Annual exams, that too, maths exam. I was not at all prepared. The I was sure that I'm going to fail on that day. The only thing that was going in my mind is what will happen if I fail. My mother will scold me, my teachers will beat me, my friends laugh at me and I have to sit in the same class with my juniors. That day I was totally down and my self confidence is zero that day. Good morning my dear teachers, parents and my dear friends. I am Pooja, I am typical Indian girl who wants to talk, talk and talk. It might be any matter, I can talk for hours. As my name Pooja, it self reflects the divine of my likes and dislikes surrounds, the Indian mythology and Indian dance forms. My aim is to become a professional classical dancer. I want to learn Bharatanatyam, Kathakali and all the Indian dance forms. My favorite person is none another than the most charming, beautiful lady in this world is my mother. She is not only my mentor but also a true friend. The inspiring thing about her is she never gave up on us though, though my father is not here. She is the most strong and hardworking woman I have ever seen. She might scold me, beat me or get angry on me. It is when I am depressed or sad. The true friend. <laughs> the true friend comes out of her. <laughs> who tries her best to make me strong and ask me to think beyond. And the same thing happened during my sixth standard math examination day. That day I spoken to my mother. Because she is the single dose of medicine whose words can cure any kind of problems. I remember her words. She said, Pooja, I am sure that you have listened the math class as well. How would one day of preparation can make you first ranker? And how would one day not preparing well will make you fail? Our success and our failures depends on our self-confidence. This is key to success. She asked me to visualize my math learnings from day one. I did the same and wrote my exam perfectly. After going to home, she asked me to make a list, which I don't have confidence on, which scares me a lot. It might be dance, it might be maths, whatever. My list was bigger. Then she said, if you want to gain confidence on each of your fear, Spend some quality of time on overcoming them. I tried to follow my mother's words and slowly slowly I started gaining self-confidence in my life. Dear friends, one important key to success is self-confidence. An important key to self-confidence is preparation. Friends, life is 10% what we experience and 90% how we respond to it. Thank you over to the host.